So there's a, there's a story. First time Hayley stayed at my house, a little sleepover. <laughs> We just lied, we lied a bit to talk for hours, eh? Yeah, so and I see it was like after town and I stayed with you all night and we were just yeah. up talking till like 4 a.m. And then I said, I had this vision, I said, I, I understand you, I, I get you. And I said, I have this vision of me proposing to on a mountaintop with a sunset. This we, is the first night we met? First night. I said, no, sure, I got this vision in my mind and like you're reaching up and I'm like, Posing on a mountain with a sunset. Hey, I remember that? First night, and then, yeah, and then it happened. There has been hundreds of the best memories with Hayley and I could go on forever, but one in particular is the 21st of June 2015. We were going to town for a few wines. Hayley had recently been overseas for one of her many pageants. We posted a photo on Facebook with the caption, We braved the storm. It was actually a really stormy night, but little did we know, Hayley's personal storm was about to lift. Uh, Paulie's mate Duncan, he was uh, meant to be here tonight, but he couldn't be because he's in Canada. And so he sent through a speech that I'm going to read on his behalf. Yeah. It has been a tough year for everybody, and as the world seems to get crazier around us, we find that the most important things in life are the ones we love. The two of you are proof of that. We came across the infamous Paulie B in town. <laughs> I won't go into any details, but let's just say when I caught up with Hayley the next day, she was filled with sunshine again. I'm actually really good. I'm, I've heard Paulie's um, a bit emotional, <laughs> so that's gonna make me more emotional. But I've actually been feeling really good this morning and surprisingly not nervous. Starting to get excited, starting to feel a little bit emotional, but yeah, starting to get very excited. Can't wait for now. Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to you all as we gather here at Sudbury to celebrate the marriage of Paulie and Hayley. You have your own memory-making centre in the house that you have together and you both enjoy the chance to play board games and play with your cats and chase sunsets and just be in each other's company. It was of course one of these sunsets chased that created the perfect spot for Paulie to propose on Mount Ruapehu. She's everything to me. But she knows it. I love her more than anything, so. Mm. I love you so, so, so much, and you're my absolute world, and I think like our paths just happen to cross right at the perfect time we're meant to be together, and I just can't believe how well everything's worked out, and you're just my absolute rock, and I love you so much. You're my everything, Hayley. I'll see you soon. Um, we've got the rest of our lives together. We've got big plans, so, just, yeah. See you soon. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> 
I will endeavour to make you feel the realness of how deep my love is for you. As a word to describe it, simply just don't exist. You are my drive, my motivation, my success, my guidance, my absolute everything, my world. You are the best thing that ever happened to me and my best friend, other than Peyton. You make me feel more happy and more loved than I ever believed was possible. You, more than anyone else, knows the realest and rawest version of myself and amazingly somehow still loves me anyway. I feel so incredibly lucky and grateful to spend the rest of my days with you. You are my love, my rock, my best friend, my teammate and soon to be husband. I'm sure you're all aware that Paul is part Maori, but he's also got a, a high percentage of German blood in him. <laughs> to touch on this German heritage, there's a great deal of significance is uh, placed on what's called the idol rice flower. And it's, it's a flower that's um, found in high in the Alps in Germany and Austria and those places. Young men, when they uh, find the one they love, they go to a lot of trouble to get this flower and present to the, their betrothed. It's, it's just a symbol of their love and devotion, basically. It's considered to be a very unique and gift only to the lady who commands a special place in this guy's heart. Blossom of snow may you bloom and grow, bloom and grow forever. Edelweiss, Edelweiss, bless my homeland forever. So being a parent is a privilege and a joy and it should never be taken for granted. And I've always been proud of you, Hayley. And sometimes, as mothers do, you stand back and you watch and marvel at how clever and capable your kids are. And there's um, always that desire to be needed as a mother, but you feel even prouder when your kids do things and don't need you and Hayley was often that kid. Hayley, you are the definition of someone whose beauty shines inside and out. It brings me great joy to know my best mate has found a wonderful woman, his true love and soulmate. And although Paulie is punching, <laughs> I think you have found a stand-up gentleman to call your husband. Paulie. Thank you for giving our girl her sparkle back. You've done nothing but love her, support her, and encourage her to be the best version of herself. I'm so grateful that someone that I love so much has someone who loves her like you do. Thank you. This year's been crazy for us. It's been crazy for everyone. 2020 is a year that people want to forget, but for us it's one that we have every reason to want to remember. I am so proud of you and what you have achieved and what we've achieved together. For me as a person who is so scared of so much, I feel like when I'm with you that I can do anything and together we're pretty unstoppable. I've been through some hard times in the last five years. Um, I wouldn't have got through it without you, 100%. You've just stood there by me the whole time. You've questioned me, you've challenged me like no one ever has. My love for you is just, I, I don't have the words to express it. So I, I just, I will live every day um, by showing you how much I feel, like how much I love you.